Hi, welcome back. This is the LilyGo T5 S3 e-paper series, and it's got a 4.7 inch e-paper display. It includes LoRa, and it has an ESP32 S3 WROOM1 chip, 16 megabytes of flash memory, 8 megabytes of PS RAM. Look at that lovely image. That's the beauty of e-paper. Even though it's not powered up, it leaves something on the display, whatever was the last thing on there. Uh, so let's see what else in the box. They have these interesting little eyelets that you can screw into the top. I guess you could attach a lanyard to this and have this hanging around your neck. Interesting approach. All right, let's see what else. Okay, so right now, this isn't does not have a mesh-tastic image available as far as I can tell. It does support Arduino IDE and Platform IO in VS Code. Onboard function, you have touchscreen, real-time clock, got your TF card right here. Got battery management, I got the 915 megahertz GPS unit. The 4.7 inch display has 16 gray levels and it's driven by an ED047 TC1 driver. Let's take a closer look. You got your reset, your power, your TF card. The they don't call this they don't call this out at all. It looks like a small serial connector. That's the USB-C connector. On this side, you've got boot. And you've got a user button here at IO48. Another interesting feature, it does support MagSafe charging on the back here. So you can just put it on a MagSafe charger. Okay, we're checking the out-of-box experience here. So it's initializing the system. Okay, cool. So it has already has a demo loaded, essentially. Let's see, clock function, calendar. Of course, we got to set the time, obviously. Let's see, I don't have an SD card, Wi-Fi. Let's see, test settings. Backlights off, refresh speed is fast. Let's see, I don't know what that is. I guess the voltage for the screen. Let's see what about system -y. Okay. Be interesting to see it with the backlight. Battery. And there's your battery stats. And GPS. Okay, nothing doing with the GPS just yet. All right. Okay, well, battery's at 100% according to this. Oh, there's another screen. Oh, shut down and sleep. Okay. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Interesting device. We could play with uh, the example sketches in Arduino IDE, so stay tuned for that. And I'm going to be watching closely to see when the Mesh Tastic image drops because this is going to be awesome with Mesh Tastic. All right, thank you very much.